He's back in the news. Don Sterling is suing the NBA for wrongfully taking away his team. So Shelly Sterling, who's his wife, who is now sort of in control of the team, is reviewing five bids, is reviewing bids from five groups who are trying to invest in the LA Clippers, um, according to the Associated Press. But Don Sterling's attorney has filed suit and said there will be no sale of the team without his client's involvement. Though he declined to say whether Sterling would be, is involved in reviewing the bids or will, tu- or will, be, who, or will check in with Shelly Sterling, he indicates that Mr. Sterling is the owner of the team and there will be no sale of the team without his involvement. They're filing suit against the NBA for wrongfully taking away Sterling's team even though Mr. Sterling is in violation of Amendment of, you know, Amendment 13 of the NBA owner's constitution, which says that you cannot, you know, wrongfully economically endanger the league. And the reason why he's in violation of that is because of his actions. A lot of advertisers and the players do not want to be involved with the team, which hurts all the owners together, collectively. Which is the big problem. But you know, I gotta tell you on this one. People are making a big deal about what Don Sterling said with the girlfriend. I think it should be a big deal, but this guy is a known racist. The fact that we didn't make a big deal about the fact that he put African Americans and, and, and Hispanics, he thought they were roaches, and put them into slums. He's a slum lord. That should be a bigger deal to us than the fact that he said some racist things about black people. The fact that he put African Americans in harm's way is a bigger deal, America. It just really is. 